was in Pop Up Boys when you first joined that shit? When I first joined Pop Up Boys, it was Brendan, Chitty, Austin, you. I think that's it. I think that's it. That was pretty much it. Brendan kind of told me that you guys were hanging out before, like, Pop Up Boys. Though. Before, like, Pop Up Boys went stupid and shit, and, like, how it was big, and, like, how it is now, like, how it got buzzed. We used to hang out, like, go to the gym and shit. I got a, this is like my third IS. He helped me fix the first IS. The trans went out and shit. So that's when I first met Brendan. And I didn't know what swinging or none of that shit was. So your your first car, you didn't even really know about swinging, but Not like you all. met Brendan? Yes, I didn't know what a wall the diff was. I didn't know what traction control. I, don't, I saw my ABS light blinking on and off. <laughs> After your first time swinging? No cap, bro. I didn't know what Damn nothing was. Diff. No cap, no cap. <laughs> so then, like, what year was that? I was a I was a junior in high school, and this is when I was like working at McDonald's. I just saved up all these checks, filming and cashed out on this IS. I bought for eight hundred dollars, bro. Eight hundred dollars, bro. Right I there. was on. It was cool. How long did it run for? <laughs> on God for like three months. Three months. Three hundred thousand miles, but I was whipping that bitch. <laughs> worth the price. Worth the price. <laughs> 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 worth the price. <laughs> bro, no for cap. sure. That car was a running. Brendan even showed me some shit. Feel me? I wasn't going to car meets or nothing. I was just hanging out with Brendan. And then me and my coworkers at McDonald's. He was like, "You want to go to the meets?" And I'm like, "Oh yeah, the meets. It's about to be lit." So I'm like, "Tokyo this is drift still, shit." Like your junior year still? Yeah, this is my junior year okay. back in uh, 2020, I think. Like. Before I think right when COVID first happened, and 2020 car yeah. meets. Okay, okay. So remember, me and my coworkers like all went to the meets and shit, and I'm talking about to see niggas like drag racing and like doing all this crazy. A shit. A bunch of fast food shit. Got there like the first <laughs> spot is about to be over there like on Gosford. This is like before all that shit got shut down over there. At, uh, oh, you're talking about Coles. Yeah, Coles <laughs> right there, bro. Went over there and saw niggas doing donuts and like vets and shit and wet shit. I was like, this is hard. I'm gonna come to this bitch like every that's Saturday. A, that's a shout out to the uh, 661 Hit Squad right there. That's yeah. who they used to be. They used to bro, go crazy they used right to there. Go crazy, bro. And ever since then, I've just been doing this shit and I've just been in this culture and it's lit. What was the first spot you ever did donuts in? The first time me ever doing donuts? All right, bro. Long live my nigga Mari, bro. The first time I did donuts was in the IS. The IS was a bucket. No other diff. This nigga Brendan like cut some line to try to make me do donuts better, some bullshit. And turned off traction. It was my first time at Gateway, bruh. It was me, my cousin Cash. I pulled up with ski masks because I was super embarrassed, <laughs> bruh. I was so scared. Hella niggas, bruh. It was when Gateway was shit, popping, bruh. Shit. No fence around Gateway or nothing. This was still 2018? This is, yeah, or 2020. Oh, yeah, so two, 2020. Oh, so two years later. So you saw it 2018, came back two years later with yeah, an IS. Yeah, bruh. Okay. Came back with an IS and. Everybody was out. Shit wait, was wait, wait. What kind of car was you driving in 2018, or were you even driving? No, I was not. I entered high school in 2018. I was a small little jit, bro. Yeah, no I didn't have a car until my junior year. Like, I had my first ever car was a 09 Impala, bro. I was not playing oh, okay, with these niggas. Okay. Front wheel drive everywhere, bro. Hey, that's nothing, though. I didn't have a car until I was a senior, and I had a fucking Nissan Altima. Hey, hey <laughs> push it, bro. It pushed, though. That do, first car play at work, bro. You gotta always My do mom something. got me, like, a 09 Impala, and I was whipping that shit for a minute. And then, like, six months after the Impala, I had two cars and got that IS, the bucket IS. Hey, that man had two cars by junior year? Me on me, I thought I was on, bro. Yeah, you <laughs> was on. Most people didn't have a, oh, a car in oh, junior God. year. So and that's then cool. all that shit went by the IS, got some burnish for it, pulled up to Gateway. There's one night at Gateway, me and my cousin. All right, look, look, you already know, pop out, you already no, know. No vibes, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> And I was so nervous, bro. This is when I first started hanging around Pop Up Boys and shit. It was at the apartment. We left the apartment, and went to Gateway, and it was Maine. Maine and Mari were right in front of my car, and they like, they called me UK nigga because I had a fucking ski mask. Yeah, I remember on. that shit. Oh God, had called me UK nigga. And you was rapping at that time. Oh God, bro. And I tried to do film me. I went inside the pit, heart beating, bro. This butterflies in my stomach. Never again. I dog anything, but butterflies in my stomach. Did the donut. It was like one wheel pill. Mm. I didn't turn off the traction or nothing, bro. This nigga, this nigga Maine and Mario was like, get out the pit. I was like, no. <laughs> Hell you knew you was like silly. <laughs> I was like, all right, bro. It's, it is what it is. After that point, the IS blew up. That got, that car was gone. And then I like struggled to have a car ever since then. I still had the Impala. Struggled to have a car. Then Brennan gave me my second IS. The trans went out on that one. It was all bad. And then like months later, I owned like nine cars after that like, like where were you Lexus. working at while you were doing that though craziest shit ever bro i'm only 19 i've had like seven or eight jobs or i think like 19, seven what? or six okay craziest shit bro like i worked at mcdonald's like taco bell ross the uh, distribution or like the not ross store? over there on gosford damn look bro, at this <laughs>
Manager ain't shit. Wait for the tow truck to pass by real quick, like he ain't see us doing an interview, but fuck uh, it. Alright, so we had McDonald's, Taco Bell, Ross, Little Caesars, P Street, me and Ed's. So I was really working like all these jobs. So that, up the until last now. two is where you do it right now, huh? That's yeah, how, right that's now I'm working at me and Ed's Pizza uh, over there on right across the street from Costco and then P, P Street right there. For sure. Shout out P Street, shout out P Street. P, they shout be giving out P Street, Street tires. on Garden Plug Tires. Shout out Juan for the job, thank you. Yes, sir. Shout out Juan. Yes. When I first became a dog and got that like ambition to just get out there and go get it, I was shout working at McDonald's, feel me? And my mom, ever since, she just told me like, you're not like nobody in our family's been a bum like at all like we don't raise bums at all so i was like bro i got all this weight on my shoulders like my mom be making all this money like my sister's about to make all this money like i'm the oldest kid so like i i can't show my sisters like a failure so ever since then i've just been on the grind and a lot of people i've just been seeing like in high school like out of all the homies like i'm the first one to get a car like i'm the first one to have like all these whips i'm the first one to just be doing all this shit and it's just not to flex on niggas and just tell niggas that they can't do it it's just like I just been on the grind ever since and like I don't really see a lot of young niggas doing this shit and I put my homies on tell my homies it's saucy feel me so we can all just get that grind so we can all just be together getting this bread and that's really it right there feel me? It looks like a bucket but this is my best is i've ever had not the best whip but the best is i've ever had the first is i had like every panel was a different color like white and gray needed to be painted like it was a piece of shit like the rear end was like hit and the second is was the one that y'all know shitty had that one sold it to him for a band a band bro sold shitty that is for a band oh god bro Months later, had like six cars, and then got this IS right here. So Shitty man. had that car for how long? He just barely got rid of it? Shitty had that car for a minute, bro. Like, really? Shitty had that car for like a whole like, year. Like, yeah. that shit was crazy. I really, I really plug bro with that one. Shout and I've been bro. thinking about that every since. Shitty since. GS. Oh, Shitty yeah. got bars right now. Shitty, Shitty got bars. Got bars bro. Shout out to bro. You we thinking about it? selling this one? I actually am thinking about doing some sick ass shit, bro, like with this car. So. Tell me year, make, model, what you got on it. This right here is a 01 IS300. It has, right now, the Alteza grill is fucking off. I took it off right before the takeover that we just had. Carbon fiber hood, aftermarket lights. These yellow little things right here, the fall things. Uh, rep TEs in the front. Stop playing. We're not, we not balling stop, right now. Stop playing. Feel me? The camera arms. Uh, flat wheel right here. We got clear tail lights. That's like really like the design in the back. It's just the clear, but I gotta get new ones because this one right here I smacked with a GA. No, you're a stunt driver smack. You don't, yeah. you don't drive. You have a stunt Tell me, yeah, I'm a stunt driver, so I really do. No, you have a stunt driver. You don't. I, oh, actually, yeah, I have a stunt driver actually. Ray Benrich, that's the that's the dude. But feel me, smack. He smacked this with a G8, and then over here on this one. Some guy was in the pit and I think he smacked him, uh, smacked him with his... A Jeep, I think. A, his Jeep? Yeah, I got his Jeep. I think I've seen that. But I just had this car over now for like three weeks, I think. Um, How'd you get this bumper delete right here? That's just kind of crazy. Got this bumper delete right before the little takeover thing that we had when Nikki and Ari and Cars came out here. Okay. Feel me? I just knew. Over, I just I was knew. I just say cut scene to where the bumper flies off on my page. <laughs> Bumper delete right here because I knew for sure that I was about to bash some shit. You could just tell. I had a great time that day. Shout out Ari and Car. Shout out Nikki Slides. You really can. Yeah, I was tripping. This is the side with the G8. This is when uh, it got bapped real quick. <laughs> Feel me? He ain't bad me. I was doing the bapping. But feel me? <laughs> that, that part messed up. But other than that, this is the IS bucket. Do you have a bumper for it? I do have a bumper for it. It's at Papa Smurf's house right now. I better go get it before he sells my bumper in two days. Shout out to Sway Films. He gave me the sticker right here, right before the uh, the little takeover thing. But this is the bucket. This is what I traded for my SN95, the uh, 97 Mustang manual. Had uh, 97,000 on it. I missed that car. The car is sick. But you traded a Mustang for the IS? Okay. I had to get back in some JDM shit. This car's a this car's. You a prefer lit. JDM or do you like uh, muscle? I prefer. Say it to the camera. Not gonna lie, bro. I prefer JDM, but hey. Muscle's up there, bro. Okay, okay. So you like that new uh, challenge, that new challenger that came? Fuck out. no, bro. <laughs> Wait, do you like Hondas? 
Not at all, bro. I'm not a Honda type of guy. I'm not for the hate. The NSX is hard because it's rear-wheel drive, but I'm a rear-wheel drive type of guy. Oh, okay.